moving on to the first sum sides of triangle are given below determine which of them are right angles in case of right angle write the length of its hypotenuse now moving on to the solution for first bit of first problem given length of sides are 7 cm 24 cm and 25 cm let us assume that these be the sides of triangle abc with ab is equal to 7 cm bc is equal to 24 cm and ca is equal to 25 cm in order to check whether given sides form a right angle triangle or not we have to verify the Pythagoras theorem from Pythagoras theorem in right angle triangle we know that hypotenuse square is equal to sum of squares of other two sides we know that in right angle triangle as Hypotenuse is the largest side. Let us take the square of hypotenuse that is CA square which is equal to 25 square which is nothing but 625. Let us take the AB square plus BC square also which is equal to 7 square plus 24 square that is equal to 49 plus 576 which is nothing but 625 again. We got here Hypotenuse square is equal to side square plus side square. So we can say that ABC is right triangle with hypotenuse CA is equal to 25 centimeters. Now moving on to the second sum. The given sides are 3 cm, 8 cm and 6 cm. Let this be the sides of a triangle ABC with AB is equal to 3 cm, BC is equal to 8 cm and CA is equal to 6 cm. Now let us take the largest side square that is BC square by assuming that it will be the hypotenuse for right angle triangle 8 square which is nothing but 64 and now AB square plus CA square is equal to 3 square plus 6 square which is equal to 3 square is 9 plus 6 square is 36 so 9 plus 36 will be equal to 45 here hypotenuse square is not equal to sum of squares of other two sides so this doesn't form a right angle triangle now moving on to the third bit the given sides are 50 centimeters 80 centimeters and 100 centimeters let us assume that these are the sides of right angle triangle ABC with AB is equal to 50 centimeters and BC is equal to 80 centimeters CA is equal to 100 centimeters now let us take the largest side square which is CA square that is equal to 100 square that is equal to 100 square is nothing but 10,000 and now we shall also find the sum of squares of other two sides that is AB square plus BC square which is equal to 50 square plus 80 square which is equal to 50 square is nothing but 2500 plus 80 square is nothing but 6400 so overall which will be equal to 8900 which is not equal to CA square Therefore, we can say that ABC doesn't form a right angle triangle. Right? 
now moving on to the fourth sum the given dimensions are 13 centimeters 12 centimeters and 5 centimeters so let us assume that these are the sides of a triangle ABC with AB is equal to 13 centimeters and BC is equal to 12 centimeters and CA is equal to 5 centimeters so let us take the largest side square which is nothing but AB square that equal to 13 square which is nothing but 169 and sum of squares of other two sides that is BC square plus CA square is equal to 12 square plus 5 square which is equal to 12 square is nothing but 144 plus 5 square is nothing but 25 so overall that will be equal to 169 here we got AB square is equal to BC square plus CA square so ABC is right angle triangle with hypotenuse is equal to 13 centimeters ABC is an isosceles triangle right angle let's see prove that AB square is equal to 2AC square now moving on to the solution 